you know, almost about 70 years ago when we got independence. Two, three hundred of, two, three hundred years of slavery and we were an absolute poor country on our knees. And when we got independence, we had to learn to know how to do things. Our entire learning was focused on how to earn a living, how to create things around us because we were absolutely at the bottom of life. We had to raise ourselves. So those skills were very important for us. So we started learning a lot of skills. We started building a lot of industry. We started building a lot of institutions and all of that. But now I see with the pandemic and everything, there's a great shift happening on earth. We're entering into a new yoga. In this new yoga, we need some really deep critical capabilities to move ahead. It is very interesting that Dr. V.P. Singh actually shared a great report with me of UNICEF in collaboration with World Bank. They talked about some cap critical capabilities and they put these critical capabilities in four quadrants. The first quadrant was learning to know, that all our learning must focus on knowing things. This we've done in the last 70 years. The second quadrant was learning to do, that our skills must allow us to do things in life. This was also last 70 years. The third quadrant was learning to be. Just be, learning to be. We're not working on that so far. I don't see we as collective humanity in India, especially working on that. The fourth quadrant was learning to live together. I think we're lacking there also because if we learn to live together, we'll not have any conflicts or we will know how to beautifully, positively manage the conflicts. These two segments, learning to be and learning to live together, as per the UNICEF report in collaboration with World Bank, is something that Sage Udalaka was trying to teach his son, Shwet Ketu. Learning to be. And when you learn to be, you know that through which everything else is known. These I call the critical capabilities that we need in this new yoga. If you see in life, everything emerges from this self. Your world, your success, your happiness, your relationship, everything comes from the root of your own self. If the foundation of these critical capabilities of knowing the self, learning to be and learning to live together, if we don't work on this, if we don't establish that, we can't create a great outward manifestation. We'll just create a world of to do. We'll not know how to be. We'll just keep doing things and we'll forget how to be.